Meghan Markle and Prince Harry are suffering a drop in popularity in the UK and US, Nigel Farage has claimed. Meghan Markle, 40, and Prince Harry, 36, stepped down from royal duties in March the 2020 and left the UK for a financially independent life in California. But the Duke and Duchess of Sussex have faced criticism for the recent interviews about royal life. GB News presenter Nigel Farage has claimed that the royal couple has done some damage with their comments, but royal fans are beginning to lose interest in them. Speaking on GB News, Mr. Farage said, it's done some damage, but I do sense a change. The polls recently, when people were asked about whether they were interested in buying or reading the new book, a vast majority were utterly and completely disinterested. I think that's why we're going with it. Most people I know don't want to hear another word from them ever again. Meghan Markle and Prince Harry are suffering a drop in popularity in the UK and US. Ultimately, they are discrediting themselves. They are doing it rapidly in this country. It's beginning to happen in the USA as well, where they're nowhere near as popular as they were before. Short-term fave hurt the monarchy. Longer term I don't think they're going to make any difference. His comments come as the royal couple were left off Barack Obama's birthday party guest list last month, a move which the royals won't get over, royal expert Angela Levin has claimed. Camilla Tormini, associate editor of The Telegraph, has claimed the Sussex's interview with Oprah Winfrey has not gone down well with the former U.S. president and first lady who always put family first. Talk radio host Mike Graham said, Of course we know they don't really have any friends, and the only friends they do have or that they count as friends are all the people who got invited to Barack Obama's 60th birthday party. But they didn't. Ms. Leving added, That's right. I'm sure they haven't got over that and won't for many years. It comes as the Duke and Duchess of Sussex are set to have a busy period after the arrival of their second child as the Sussexes launch content for the Netflix and Spotify projects. Harry and Meghan signed multi-million dollar contracts with Netflix and Spotify to create content for the platforms after leaving the royal family in March the 2020. Royal commentator Omid Scobie has claimed after months of leave for the royal couple, they are getting ready for a busy period. After this information was posted, many fans commented that colon. Blah. They haven't any real fans here. Just celebrities and fans of Princess Diana, that adore Harry, but are sickening of his first wife's drivel. This story couldn't possibly be true, because white people are not longer the majority race in the United States. And what do you think about that? Question mark.